Hello everyone and welcome into another psychological uh, discussion. Today's uh, topic will be neurotransmitters, the chemical messengers that transmit messages between neurons. Uh, acetylcholine uh, within the intricate web of our uh, brain's uh, chemistry, uh, delicate symphony of uh, uh, chemical uh, messages shapes our, our thoughts, emotions, and physical uh, sensations. The neurotransmitters uh, enchanting uh, couriers that navigate the vast ex expanse of our neural landscape, uh, acetylcholine, the conductor of uh, muscle movements, uh, directs our very step, blink, and uh, heartbeat while uh, nurturing our focus, uh, memory, and attention. Uh, endorphins, the mystical alchemist, bring, uh, brings us uh, the euphoric uh, embrace of uh, runner's high and the comforting uh, shield against pain's relentless sting. And there in the depths of our brain's reward system, uh, dopamine, whispers its uh, siren song of pleasure, motivation, and voluntarily motion. But treat, treat it lightly, for uh, too little dopamine uh, veils us into a clock of Parkinson's, uh, while an excessive, uh, an, an excess uh, un unravels the mind's tapestry giving uh, birth to the enigmatic uh, labyrinth of uh, schizophrenia. Uh, this is a journey with, uh, through the delicate dance of neurotransmitters where the balance of these uh, mystical molecules shapes the very essence of uh, our human uh, experience. So let's dive a little bit deeper into the neurotransmitters. Again, will be some of these lectures will be same repeated words, but the idea again is for you to observe them, suck them in, and memorize them. And the chemicals, uh, messages that transmit messages between neur uh, neurons, uh, acetylcholine involved in uh, muscle movements. Acetylcholine also helps us uh, to walk, talk, blink, swallow, and breathe. It also regulates our ha heart rate and supports uh, digestion. Acetylcholine helps us uh, to focus, remember, and pay attention. Endorphins. Endorphins help us feel a runner's high when we exercise and block pain signals. Dopamine involved in voluntary muscle movements, pleasure and motivation. Too little uh, dopamine, uh, you contract uh, Parkinson's disease. Too much, uh, you contract schizophrenia. Uh, that's what supported. This is a great uh, overview of some important uh, neurotransmitters and uh, their associated uh, functions and conditions. Here are some uh, additional information on the neurotransmitters I just mentioned. Uh, acetylcholine is involved in uh, various functions throughout the body in the peripheral uh, nervous system. It plays a role in transmitting signals to the muscles, enabling muscle movements. It is also involved in uh, autonomic uh, functions such as uh, regulating heart rate and supporting digestion. In the central nervous system, acetylcholine uh, is involved in cognitive processes such as attention, learning, and memory. Uh, disorders associated with acetylcholine uh, imbalances include Alzheimer's disease where is a decrease in acetylcholine uh, levels 
Endorphins. Endorphins are uh, neurotransmitters that are involved in the regulation of pain and promotion of feelings of pleasure and well-being. Uh, they are released in a res uh, response to virus uh, stimuli, including exercise, stress, and pain. Endorphins have uh, analgesic properties, which means they can help uh, block pain signals and uh, produce a sense of euphoria or a runner's high during exercise. They play a role in uh, the body's natural pain uh, management system. Uh, dopamine. Dopamine is a neurotransmitter involved in virus functions, including movement, reward, pleasure, and motivation. It is uh, associated with voluntary muscle uh, movements and is involved in the brain's reward pathways, influencing uh, feelings of pleasure and reinforcement. Dopamine is also involved in regulating uh, mood, attention, and learning. Imbalances in dopamine levels have been implicated in several uh, neurological and uh, psychiatric uh, conditions. Too little dopamine is associated with Parkinson's disease, uh, neurodegenerative uh, disorder characterized by movement difficulties. Con conversely, an excessive dopamine activity is uh, associated with conditions like schizophrenia, where, is, uh, where it is believed to contribute to symptoms such as uh, hallucination and delusions. Understanding the role of neurotransmitters and their imbalances in virus conditions helps researchers and cl clinicians develop uh, targeted uh, treatments and interventions for uh, neurological uh, and psychiatric uh, disorders. Thank you for listening and see you on the next.